Welcome! In front of me is an Honor 200 Pro and today I will show you how you can import your contacts from the SIM card to the device. To get started, you will want to open up your standalone contacts application. So there is one in the Tools folder. There we go. Now the default Contacts application isn't necessarily the greatest as it shows you contacts from your SIM card, Google accounts, and additionally also the ones that you will import all at the same time. So right now there's no contacts whatsoever and you're seeing all these contacts on the SIM card. So they have this little SIM icon right here. Now to import them, all we need to do is just tap right here on these uh, three dots, select settings, and then import export and import from SIM. This will show you all the contacts that are on your SIM card. You can quickly select all of them right over here. Uh, I only have like five, but obviously if you have like 100 of them, it might be obviously quicker to click right here. And from there, you can also deselect contacts that you, for instance, don't want. Once that's done, click on import. Now this will show, uh, give you a couple options where you can import your contacts to. For me, it shows me the phone and you could scroll down on it. Uh, usually you will see additional options, maybe Google accounts uh, or some other accounts. I don't have any other ones, so it only gives me phone as an option as this is the only option I have. So I'm gonna just click on it. And now when we go back to our contacts list, we now have uh, basically duplicate contacts showing up because I imported most of them. So it's showing me the ones from the SIM card that still have the little SIM card icon and the ones that I have imported, which is the same contact. Now, with that being said, like I said, this isn't necessarily the greatest application. So what I would recommend doing is just going over to Play Store and probably downloading the uh, phones application from Google. Google application allows you to show um, contacts from a specific location, like the phone itself, the Google accounts or the SIM. So it allows you to just have a neat organized list of contacts uh, compared to well this, which just gives you a mumbled uh, mess of contacts from each different location all being displayed at the same time. But in any case, um, in terms of importing it, I believe once you import your contacts, they will be showing up in the phone's contact as well. So you don't need to worry about that. Anyway, um, with that being said, Hope you found this very helpful and if you did, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.